In this video, we will be dividing rational expressions and we will solve four problems. This right here would be the first problem. This would be the second problem the third problem, and finally the fourth problem. So let's get started with the first problem. And so what we're gonna to wanna to do here is instead of dividing, we're gonna to wanna to multiply. So we will say one divided by x minus four times uh, division, we flip this. So instead of three divided by four x minus 16, we say four x minus 16 divided by three. And this right here would be equivalent. If we flip this part right here, we would have to multiply. And so the next step is, is to try to factor this term and try to cancel out any terms. So we get one divided by x minus four times uh, four parentheses x minus four divided by three. And what we notice here is that we have a common term. So this and this are common. So we can simply cancel, cancel. And so our final answer that's simplified would be four divided by three. Simply one times four divided by three. And this right here is the final answer to the first problem. And now we'll do the second problem. It's still very much similar. So right now what we have is this, four minus eight x divided by three everything would be divided by uh, 2x minus 1 divided by 1. Instead of dividing, what we typically want to do is multiply. So we would get 4 minus 8x divided by 3 times, we flip it, so 1 divided by 2x minus 1. And the next step is, is to try to factor maybe this term to see if we can cancel this out. And we'll just try it. If we factor out a negative 4, we get negative one plus two x divided by three times one divided by two x minus one. So two x minus one, two x minus one. So it's a match. So we can cancel this, cancel this, and so our final answer would be negative four divided by three. And we simply need to box in this answer. And now we will do the third problem. So the third problem is actually a little bit different. It's still very much the same though. So it's just how we write what we have. So we can rewrite this by saying one divided by x squared minus 16 times x minus four divided by five. This is something we had to actually maybe uh, take note of or memorize. So one divided by this term times this term divided by this. And so the next step is to try to factor maybe this out. So we get one divided by x plus four times x minus four uh, times x minus four divided by five. And we see, can we cancel a term out? Yes, this and this will be canceled. And so our final answer would be one divided by five times x plus four. And so we simply need a box in this answer. And now we have one more problem. And so the, the last problem is almost the same as what we previously just did. So we simply re rewrite this. We get one divided by x plus one times x divided by five. So times x divided by five. Um, we can't factor anything. So our final answer would simply be x divided by five times that. So five times x plus one, and we simply box in this answer. And that's all we need to do for these four problems.